Hey, good evening from Wilmington, North Carolina. I'm the legend, that's Molly. Tonight we're just doing a night out on the town. Gonna bar hop, do some brewery stuff, but we're mostly here to go check out the Sarrow Drowner, which is a new tiki bar that was built in an old theater. So I'm very excited for this, should be pretty different. Have high hopes. So we've been here about 10 minutes. Our first round of drinks just showed up and I love it here. Um, very nice menu, a combination of like their own signature cocktails and every tiki classic you might want, as well as some other drinks. But the, the setting in here is it's just stupendous. Uh, Inside, what is their menu? It's the background of every single character. Yes, it is. Um, all your only wait staff is in character. Um, it's very, very, I would say it's inspired by the old Adventurers Club at Pleasure Island between the characters and the oath, and um, except this is gonna have much better drinks. I mean, those look fantastic. Um, Molly got hers, that's a souvenir mug you could buy, uh, made by uh, Trader Brandon, who does a lot of tiki mug stuff, but this, you do have to make reservations here, but it is so cool. The next round, I got the three dots and a dash. I tend to go for more classic tiki cocktails. Molly went for another custom drink, and the mug is really cool. Yes, it's a very cool mug. They also have entertainment. There's been a kind of a burlesque dancer and the comedian, in addition to all the, uh, the weight step being in character. It's a very neat spot. So we went for something off the, uh, the, the specialty drink menu this yes. time. And we got a sharing beverage. And it is gigantic. It is really big. The mug's really cool. And it's the first one that has the name on the back. Most That's of them have been on the bottom. On the bottom, yeah. So I can't recommend the Sarrow Drowner enough. Um, what an awesome, totally unique place. Very. Uh, I was talking to some of the people that have been there a while, and it, they, the inspiration was the Adventurers Club on Pleasure Island, and it they felt that way. Orlando, yeah, uh, you could tell it felt that way from the the oath with the same gag to the character actors. Oh man, uh, uh, really great, good tiki drinks, uh, really cool mugs. They normally do swizzle sticks. They're on back order. Yes. But uh, that place was so so really cool now we're gonna do some uh, some brewery at high wire brewing high wire brewing pretty cool place they've got uh i believe 24 beers on draft um some cool artwork and uh very interesting games there's like shuffle puck down at the end you've got ping pong and then something I don't think I've ever seen at a brewery, I really haven't seen much of anywhere, and that is uh, like soccer billiards. I've seen this at Perfect Day at Coco K, and not really anywhere else. So that's cool having a brewer, uh, brewery. For drinks here at High Wire, we went a flight, and we got the, the kind of the wackier kind of beer. So we got a, a pink lemonade ale. Which is really good. Really, really nice. Uh, the double double IPA, mm -hmm. and then some very interesting sounding stouts. There's a cookies and cream and a creme brulee. Well, on our 15 minute walk to get to downtown, found this house, which uh, kind of looks like the Disneyland Haunted Mansion a little bit. A little, yeah. We have almost made it to our dinner. We walked past the First Bank Memorial Water Garden. And uh, what a beautiful, tranquil little area. Check that out. We made it to downtown and we're gonna grab some food here because I am super hungry at Slice of Life Pizzeria and Pub. The food has arrived. I got a, uh, a slice with bacon and pepperoni and then six garlic parmesan wings. Molly, we were here in Wilmington last year and our favorite bar was this one right here, the Pour Tap Room, which is a pour your own beer, beer bar. Yes, a construction was here last year. I think so, yeah. <laughs> but it was the best. So if you've never been to one of these before, you uh, register your credit card, you get a, a magic band more or less, and then you go and you tap Mickey to Mickey, and then you get charged by the ounce, just like you're at the gas pump. It is, it's such a cool place. <laughs> 